Hi, in this training series we're going to learn how to add a shade to the app. As you can see we're currently in the zone screen. Let's press the zone button. The app will ask you to allow to use your location. Press always allow. The app will also ask you for speak recognition for voice control. Press OK or press don't allow. The app will find the remote control Bluetooth. Select the one you wish to connect to. I've chosen SPS-110500. The actual serial number of this number is on the back of your remote control. Next, select the type of warning you have. I will choose window warning. Now you can name your device. I'll call this device outside area warning. The serial number field is optional and the company purchase from is where you bought your product. Once you've set and created and filled out all the fields, press connect. The app will search for the Bluetooth remote and it will appear once it's find it, found it. Now I'm going to add a multi-channel remote. So I can press the top right hand plus button and search for my multi-channel remote control. In this case it's SPF 911000 and this can be found on the back of your remote control. Select what your device is, name it, company you purchase from, and connect. You now see we have two devices on our shade screen. To connect to the remote control to control your awning, press on one of the tiles. I'm going to press on the outside area awning. The app will connect to the remote control and now you can control the awning. To go back to the other remote control, press the top left hand icon arrow. Now we can control the multi-channel awning. As you can see, there is five icons on the top of the screen. One icon represents each channel. If I want to select channel three, I click on the third icon. I also can go into the settings wheel and name the title of my shades. I can just show each one I want to see. So if you only have three channels on your remote control, you can just show three. Or if you like to name them, you can create a name for each one. Press OK and you'll see the awnings are now named. To go back, press the top left hand button. If you would like to delete a remote control, all you need to do is slide to the left and press delete.